That's why your tramp stamp crooked. And your heels lean to the left. And your earlobes are attached. How is the family doing today? I hope y'all are having a good one with me because you know anytime I get to jump on here with y'all, it's always a good one for me. So as you can see, we're back on everybody's beloved game. You can read it. You can see it. You already know where we're at. We got stuff to load. We got people to help us, but they're just standing there. Oh, wait. They don't touch this stuff. Oh, well, who cares? Anyways, um, yeah, on today's conquest yes i said conquest we're trying to see if we can hey vehicles can you shut the hell up please i'm trying to talk we're trying to see if um we can expand the store because for the simple fact of um your boy has been working hard in the store we have been putting in the work we have been doing any and everything we can do to make this store better and i'm not gonna lie even though we have debt to pay we have been doing our damnness to make this the best damn store ever gotta buy some more cereal because we don't got it i'm gonna have to have a talk with that delivery driver because he just 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 look at him just threw my shit just like come on now how did you do this like how did you greg and gregory you could be helping me load this stuff but hey but yeah i'm, I'm gonna see if i can have a talk that amazon driver because you know they just be throwing packages like crazy and just yeet them and then just keep going i'm just like well damn <clears throat> Oh shit, sorry about that, almost died. But anyways, uh, today's goal is to see if we can make enough money. We'll check to see how much it is to upgrade it. And where is it? Uh, no, I was, no, I was in the right place. Management to, no, that's license growth. We need 2,600. That's not bad. But that also doesn't give us much wiggle room. I'm gonna open I'm gonna go ahead and open up the store. But it doesn't give us much wiggle room to work with on trying to uh like do what we need to do if you know what I'm saying. Where the fuck can I put this? I just yeet it up there then, huh? How about that? But before this this store gets crazy, I'm gonna go ahead and uh show it to you guys real quick once i finish throwing all of this stuff in there if we got places to put it if not we're gonna have to start putting it on the floor that's what we also need is um we need more um we need more shelves in here but we just can't afford it we just live broke we live in check to check over here Hello, welcome to uh, Shell Mart. Uh, I'll be with you in a second. We added this, we moved this. Um, so yeah, as you can see, everything just looks fine. Why are y'all behind the cash register? It's too expensive. Is it too expensive? Come on, man. Let me go ahead and change that for y'all. I'll be right there. Give me one second, ma'am. I hope he's paying the $6 price instead of the price I just changed it to. Some of y'all may ask, why don't I just go ahead and use the keyboard to do this? Because I don't want to. That's why. If you got a problem with it, take it up with my manager. Because he said not to use... No, wait, hold on. I run this business. This is my business. I'm my own manager. Screw it um yeah we we just do what we want to do over here come on i'm gonna need you guys to i'm gonna need you guys to buy some more stuff okay because i'm trying to expand the store and i can't expand like this guy right here look at you love it beautiful here's your five pence back have a good day uh nice to meet you james bond i, I watched a lot of your movies i played your game uh 007 golden eye as a child that game was beautiful loved it um need to play it again uh 
that game I would love to see is like an online multiplayer game because uh, playing 007 Goldeneye with the with friends and family that that broke relationships right there. That game would have you mad at everybody in the household for no reason. Oh man. I remember I remember younger playing that game and whenever somebody got the golden gun, you just like come on now, that ain't fair. That's a one shot kill. I can't remember if it had like one bullet or something in it though, like that, just to make it more fair. But it was always in the same spot and everybody made a mad dash for it. So it was just like a bloodbath over there in the this is the bathroom in the ceiling, I believe. It's just a bloodbath over there. And then whoever got it, they was just like unstoppable. But that is in the past. We will get back to that one day, hopefully. But until then, we're here at the supermarket. We're here working hard. We're here serving these people good, wholesome, um, multi-grain, um, um, we, we, sir, I'm going to turn and look at this wall. And when I do, there better be more stuff right here, okay? Okay, turtle, when you turn back around, hopefully this man listened to your advice and went and got food. Do not backhand him. If there's nothing there, just take his card and cash him out and tell him never come back, okay? Okay. Well, hello. Give me his fucking card and get out of my store. Because I swear if you come back, I'm going to slap you. There, take your dollar. Get out. Why is everybody and their mama spending, like, just a few bucks? I'm going to need you guys to spend more. Get out. Like this fine gentleman right here. I love it. Look at this. This is beautiful. And he ain't need no change. That's how I love it. Well, hold on. Almost tried to jip her. I wouldn't have mind though. We need the money. We're trying to expand. And you can't expand if you don't have money. Well, how I would have gave her money if she would have took an act. Uh, who said I ain't the fastest at what I do? Everybody loves me. I should have turned on the light while I was back there talking to myself. I mean, having a meeting with my employees because I'm self-employed. Hold on, let me turn on this light, everybody. Well, just ignore that. All right, we're back. Sorry about that. Hey, everybody, it is now 6 o'clock. I repeat, it is now six o'clock. We close in the next three hours. So uh, you don't need to rush, but uh, you don't need to stay here. So hurry up, please. Why, why? Why do they come here to break their money? Who, like, Greg, did you put up the sign yet that says we don't break anything over 100 yet? Because until you do that, I have to keep honoring that gonna come up in my store just so they can they can break their money nah I'm gonna break some legs they keep doing it sir I'm gonna need you to buy more okay that's why you don't need no change especially you you look like you you look like you do nothing but drink protein I'm gonna need you to do more than that give me this uh, $13 and 60 cents. Now get out. Okay, my guy, Mr. Adam. You, uh, you must be having somebody over tonight. I, Cause I, I know your, 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 your divorce and your wife took everything. You know, I'm just going to shut up. You have a good day now. Yeah, girl. That man that just walked out of here, divorce. His wife took everything. Crazy, ain't it? Small world. Uh, excuse me? That's your ex-husband? Um, awkward. 
Keep going. Get out my store, please. There you go. I need to stop talking to these people. That's what makes it to where I can't do my job at home. That's what, that's what really makes it to where I can't do my job in real life. I start talking to people, and then I lose track of time, and I'm like, oh, dude. Dude, come on, man. I'm just like, damn, man. I didn't sit here and damn near take a break talking to these people. Oh, and today, well, a.k.a. Tuesday, because when y'all's getting this, this will be... No, Monday, because when y'all's get this, this will be... Oh, Wednesday, but man, oh man, was it oh so fun at work on Monday. Let me tell you about it. So first off, it's 6.50 in the morning. It's already too early for me. I'm a night person, but I work a morning job. I know, uh, fight me about it. Crazy, huh? But anyways, um... Walk in there, I'm just like, okay, it's Monday. Monday is just like, make today longer. Everybody, I'm gonna need you to wrap up real quick because it is nine o'clock and we are officially closed. So I'm gonna need y'all to wrap up and get over here to this cash register so I can check you out. Okay, thank you. But anyways, um, walk in there, I'm just like, oh, it's gonna be a typical Monday. Nope. The first thing somebody says to me is, hi. The next thing they say to me is, oh yeah, the network is down nationwide, so uh, have fun with that information there. I said, wait, what? They said, yeah, nationwide. It's not on your side today, if you know what I mean. But anyways, um, it's, it's just a nationwide outage, okay? And I've already got BS in my back pocket, just chilling there waiting to fuck up today sitting there waiting i'm just like mm, i can smell the chicanery a mile away sure enough they is like oh yeah we we still going on road i don't i don't know why y'all think y'all not but we still going on road i said oh great and then my co-worker he was on a rant today this man this man <laughs> this man so the coffee machine was broken and he he was going off because he ain't had no coffee. He was like, oh, so y'all want us to do all this work and only gave us a 2% raise. Like, he was going off. Like, I, I wish I would have recorded that stuff because it was just so funny. It's just like, it's just like, my guy, if you don't like it, leave. I was like, because it's, it's just said and done and they already done told you what we got to do today. And that's go out there in this, in this rain and stuff and work like we ain't never worked before. All right, everybody. Uh, it's the end of the day, so let's see what we got. And we will finish this story right here in a brief second, okay? All right. 45, 0, 6, 0, 51. Okay, okay, I see, Ash. I see, Ash. But, um, yeah, let me finish that story for you. Um, so where was, um, yeah, my coworker rant. I'm just like, my guy, shut up, please. Cause you're making this hard on everybody else. And shit, we do not got enough to, uh, fucking upgrade. Um, so yeah, he's just, just going off like this, that, and the third. I ain't doing shit. I ain't doing anything they tell me to do. I'm just like, you... Do you need a job? Because I'm, I'm pretty sure there's people out there that'll gladly be like, hey, I'll I, I take your job if you don't want it. Like, I'm 100% sure that there's people out there that are just like, hey, like, you don't want that job? I'll gladly take that bitch. So I'm just like, okay, just... I'm down, take a deep breath, you know. Everything's gonna be okay. And just like he left out of that building, like throw that under there, right? Dang. He just left out of that building, like pissed off at the world. I was like, damn, who pissed in his Cheerios? 
And then when I found out he ain't had no coffee, I was like, mm, that explains everything. I was like, I feel his pain, but I ain't gonna be shitty towards the manager, even if they are doing a horrible job. I almost threw that away. I had to seriously check in there. So then we fast forward now. I am now on road, okay? I am out there doing my thing. I am being the best driver that I can be. And I fell miserably at that bitch today. Whoo, buddy. I failed miserably. Oh, wow. We're finally low on a lot of shit. I should have bought more shit than what I bought. But anyways, yeah. Just like I'm getting destroyed out there. Not only to mention that um, the area I do, I normally don't do. So now I'm over here taking stuff that I don't take. And I'm just like confused about the stuff. But what was the icing on the cake is that um we finally got to go ahead to that the system is back up we're all like that yes let's go let's do this i don't drive a normal truck like everybody else everybody else got like the big vans or the sprinters or the the like bigger trucks like the delivery trucks i'm over here in a van and so when they said the system is up, you have to scan everything in your truck so they know that you have it. So I'm at a gas station just parked, just tucked off into a corner, just looking sketchy as hell, <laughs> scanning all of this bullshit in the back of my truck. I'm like, come on, I don't get paid enough to do this. I was like, I just want to go home. I was like, I'm over today. I was like, normally I don't complain about... um uh work where the fuck did i put that oh right there but i was like yeah normally i don't complain too much about work because i mean if you don't complain about work are you actually like working i mean even people that have their dream jobs they complain about it it's a proven fact and y'all know it um but yeah, I'm just like, man. And it's about to start raining, too. I was just like, yeah, today's about to be a good day. Oh, and it, it ended up it ended up being a good it ended up being a good day too, because I can guarantee you when I go into work tomorrow, they gonna have some shit to say. Cause like I was out there doing what I had to do. To get shit around and they just looking at me they probably was looking at my stuff and was like what the hell is this boy doing hmm we told him to get out there and do what he had to do to to get this stuff delivered correctly on time they're like yes we did tell them that so they're probably like, ah, oh, yeah, we about to chew this motherfucker out as soon as he walked through that door. As soon as they walk through the door, they're going to be like, Turtle, come here. I'm just I'm like, man, ain't this some bullshit? But yeah, that that is that is how my Monday went. And I'm recording this the night of, so yeah. It's always fun working where I work at. Like you, you either hate it or you love it. It's one of the two. And I honestly love what I do. I'm not even gonna lie to you. It and it's not even about making good money or not. It's it's about um, interactions with people that get out there. Like it's it's so much fun. Like everybody i've met amazing people like i have stories to tell upon stories to tell just about the chicaner things that go on at the workplace i won't lie it's like 300,000 degrees uh in my bedroom i mean it's not even my bedroom it's the living room that sits 
off side of my bedroom and it's just I'm slowly dying of a heat stroke will help if I didn't have two shirts on but hey that's a story for another day you don't need to know why I'm wearing two t-shirts okay fine I came home and um, haven't taken my uniform top off pants been gone basically when I hit the steps gone I'm just like okay you do what you got to do I'm gonna keep going because I'm not stopping for you but um yeah still got on a uniform shirt uh and i always just ever since i was little i've always always worn uh two t-shirts so i would have my regular t-shirt and then i would have uh whatever i was wearing over that if that does if that doesn't just make your mind go like huh But anyways, yeah, back to the game. We got to get this done. Uh, have you guys watched enough of me just go back and forth of stocking shelves for um, the store? There we go. I was like, what the hell was I going to say right here? Oh, well. But anyways, I think I'm going to cut it there and pick this right back up after this sponsored break right here. No, there is no sponsor. There is, there's definitely no sponsor. Your boy is nowhere close to having anything that revolves around having sponsors. Your boy is just on here until this becomes something else. This is a hobby. Can you say it with me now, everybody? Say hobby. Good. Now, don't forget that, okay? But I am going to skedaddle because I feel like if I keep recording this and talking and stuff like that, uh, it's going to be one hell of a video. So I will see y'all back here in a few seconds to y'all, but probably like two hours to me. But I'll be right back. All right, family, I'm back after that little debauchery that I had going on there. The little chicanery, uh, the little, um, you know, the, the project. Uh, hey, ma'am, 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 can I talk to you for a second? Hey, may I say your skirt looks very stunning today and so does your makeup. It doesn't look horrible at all. So could you please, when that shop opens up over there, could you please shop at it, please, please? I'm begging you, please, please, ma'am, ma'am, please, please, ma'am, ma'am, please, please. That's why your tramp stamp crooked and your heels lean to the left and your earlobes are attached. <laughs> Oh man, that's too funny, but I did it. I expanded the store, I had to do it. As you can see, I only got $13, $19.30 left. This is like the freezer section right here. Uh, you got everything else. I will be getting another shelf here, but as you can see, your boy ran out of monies. And you need monies to do things and i really don't have a lot of monies to do much of anything right now so yay so that is a thing but hey we will make it work we will get to the top and we will not lose this store oh seems like we got customers hey how you doing sir welcome to shell mart oh, please don't come again I'm gonna need you to buy more stuff. The freezer section has been moved, everybody. If you come through the door and just look straight ahead, you will see it. I will not be repeating myself all day, even though I know I will. Oops, sorry about that. Oh, oh no, hold, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, E. I was about to say there's no cash register open. Ooh, I almost messed that one up. Almost messed that one up big time, everybody. Ma'am, please, please make your way around the store. Don't just go to one section. Make your make make your way around the store. Make sure I fix prices too. I think they're fair. Some have went up, some have came down. So please shop to your heart's content. Oh, I thought I was already there. This looks like a little good uh 
Uh, bunch there, John. I'm gonna need you to tell the wife and kids I said hello. Yep, have a good day, John. Man, John does not know that his wife is trying to get with this guy that's walking towards me right now. Mr. Frank, how are you doing today? How are you have you're having a lovely day being a billionaire? That's good. That's good. Uh, keep the change. Thank you. I see you found everything in the store today, ma'am. Did you have any problems? Damn, you have RBF. I'm gonna need you to fix that shit ASAP because I can't have you in my store scaring off customers like that. Hi, hey, sir. Did you find everything good? You did? Appreciate it. We moved the store around a little bit, so I hope it wasn't too confusing for you. I appreciate you for uh, uh, coming on through and supporting your local business. Thank you. Mark, how's the wife and kids doing? They're doing great. That's great. I hope little Susie is ready to have a play date with Margaret. Have a good one. I'm over here talking to these people like I got actual lives with these people. Didn't I tell you to fix that face last time? That's why your weave crooked. Give me this. Get out of my store and don't come back until you fix that damn face of yours and that weave. Appreciate you, sir. One dollar. One dollar. Here you go. Have a good day. I'm going to need you to buy more. And I better not see one person say, oh, this stuff is too expensive. You broke if you say that because I adjusted the prices to everything. I adjusted the prices to everything in here. Like, as you can see, I'm getting like five cents and I hate that. It's not that I don't know what I'm doing. It's just a simple fact that that's annoying. See, like this, if I'd have had to collect this from him, I'd have been annoying. Have a good day. It's more annoying when you got to do it in, in real life. Because, like, because, like, um, it just feels more pressure when you're doing it in real life. Like anytime somebody comes outside while I'm trying to find a package in my truck, I'm just like, I'm not gonna find a. Did you just say something? Ma'am, ma'am, did you just say something was too expensive? Did you just say, didn't I tell, didn't, didn't I tell you don't bring your ass back in here? Oh, they saying the checkout is full. My bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. Uh, how much I owe you, sir? Here you go. Um. Once we get uh once we get enough money, we are gonna have to get a second cash register. I might have to run both of them still because I'm still faster than these people that you hire, and it saves me more money if I do it myself. You know what I'm saying? Killing two birds with one stone. I mean, if you don't like that, saying um you can go with um I don't know, make something up. I ain't trying to do it. At least not today. I'm going to need you to buy more than a personal pizza and I chocolate, I think that was. Not 100% sure. I really didn't look at it. I just grabbed it. 52 cent. I can do that. Get out. My, are y'all's... What is it? A tuplets? Is there eight of you? I think that's how you say it. If I'm wrong, correct me in the comments, please. Oh, uh, I was giving you way too much money. Hey there, Paul. I'm gonna need you to, uh, do better next time you come in here. White suit man. And yes, that is exactly once he, what he wants to be called. That's just not me saying that because that is what he is wearing. That is me saying that because that's what he wants to be called. Not my store, sir. Like, I called him by his actual name because he told me that, and he said, nope, mm -mm, you call me that again, I'm going to have to sacrifice you to uh, the giant chicken. And I was like, what's the giant chicken? He took a stick with a chicken head on it, turned it upside down, and started beating the ground with it, saying, arise, chicken, arise. And if you don't know where that is from, I, I don't I don't think we can be friends. I'm sorry. I'm just saying that. 
If you don't know nothing about Aqua Team Hunger Force back in the day on Adult Swim on Cartoon Network, you didn't have a real childhood. And if you don't know what that is, you're probably too young. I'm gonna need you to go uh go watch some Roblox or something like that. Is uh yeah, just go watch some Roblox now, okay? A race chicken, a race. Or he uh he had them say now I'm gonna uh uh, what the hell? I can't even remember what I was gonna say. Like, it was funny as hell, though. If y'all don't know what it is, go check it out. You can probably find it on YouTube somewhere around here. Uh, funny as hell. Just go check it out. You will not regret it. Matter of fact, if you regret it, I will give you the, a hug. Because your boy's broke and don't have money to be giving nobody. Not even to my own bills. I just look at them and be like, do you need the whole thing? Not half of the thing? They're like, nah, we need the whole thing. And I'm just like, could y'all just like hold half of it? Like, like could you hold like a 75% a, a of it and I'll bring the rest like in three days? And they just like, nah, nah. See, we're going to have to do that, or are you going to have to break your legs? Like, you're not going to break your legs, but we're going to break your legs. And I'm just like, but my legs are already bad. I got bad knees. They're like, that ain't no problem. I'm just like, okay, I'm sorry. I'll have it all. And do I got to have it all right now? They're like, you got to the end of the day. Cool. And then I just... I just go outside and start picking up change. I was going to say something chicanerous, but I'm just going to keep that one to myself. Our shelves are empty, and it's going to suck when it comes down to buying day. But I do like that we was at, like, hardly anything, and the damn near got all our money back. Like, that's nice. I love it. I wish you would, uh... I wish you could make more by just expanding the store. Okay, that's not a bad price there. Mm, look at that. I'm going to need you to buy more than three bottles of water. I do not care if you're dehydrated. You better dehydrate your ass over there and pick up some candy or something. Shit, we got bleach over there if you want to drink that too. Please don't drink the bleach. That's all I got to ask. Oh yeah, this this the store was hit hard, but that is a okay because people, it is nine o'clock. So if you could make your way up to the register, please, I would greatly appreciate that. Huh, we made good money. I hate you right now. You know that? I hate you. You're a billionaire, and you're gonna do this to me for the fun of it. Yeah, hold your head in shame. You need to get the rest of that shit cut off your head. I don't, can somebody just explain to me why, like, I would probably do the same thing, like, if I ever was in that situation to where, um, like, I'm, like, going bald or something like that, but I guess I just don't understand, because I have hair, but could y'all just tell me why, why do they keep, like, that, like, halo type thing on their head? Like the same, the same co-worker that I was telling y'all as he uh, was complaining about everything. He, he was bald like that one guy that was holding his head in shame. And he goes and gets a haircut. And I'm just like, why? And he never tells me why. I mean, I would like to understand it more. So I won't be like, why the fuck is he going to go get a haircut? I'll be like, oh, my guy won't got a haircut. But I mean, hey, it is what it is. Do what you want to do. Do what makes you happy. Even if people talk behind your back about it. All right? Like, for real. That's that's one thing with this channel we need to do over here. We need to keep everything positively good. We will not slander or hate over here. We just spread nothing but love and care and kindness and all the good stuff in between. 
All right, sounds good. Oh yeah, and you gotta go fishing every Saturday. That's a must. Every Saturday. Don't care what time you get up, just go fishing. I'm telling you, at at the end of your fish, you don't even gotta fish all day, but at the end of your fishing, um, your fishing trip, you gonna feel like a new person. I'm telling you, I love fishing. Like honestly, after the day I had, if I could have went fishing, well, as again, y'all are getting this Wednesday. I'm recording this Monday night. But like I said, if I could have went fishing after work today, I would have been delicious. But um, let's take a quick look around the store. We're definitely gonna need some more uh, cleaner, some more bleach. Uh, the rice and cereal is good. We need some better lighting back here. Sugar looks good. Um, peanut butter looks good. Cereal. We need some more flour. Um, olive oil looks good. This flour looks good. Candy, toilet paper, salt, milk, coffee. That's tea, dumbass. Um... I know we got plenty of that. We're gonna have to buy some more of that. Oh yeah, we definitely need some lights over here because I can't see shit in this thing. I'm blind as fuck. Yeah, I, I, I knew there was something wrong here. I so would have to fix that, but I don't feel like it. So let's see how we did. Two products found that was expensive. I wonder which two was they because I didn't leave a lot of them the same I changed like everything and to spend all our money which was roughly almost four thousand dollars and to have a total of negative nine hundred nine hundred five dollars and sixty one cents we killed that shit we definitely killed that shit but I am not going to start the next day. I'm actually going to end it right here. And I hope y'all enjoyed this chicanerous ass video because I 100% did. This was hilarious. I had fun with it. And yeah, I'm just trying to have a better outlook on things and to have more energy when I do these videos because uh, my sister, and a few other people pointed out to me that, hey, I sound tired. And yes, I am tired. I do work a full-time job. But hey, that's no excuse for me to not come on here and give y'all the same energy. Matter of fact, I'm giving y'all more energy than I do at work. Because like, at points in times, I'm just ready to go home and just start working on this. Because I love this. I have fun doing this. And I hope y'all enjoy these videos that I put out. <sighs> been sorry about that by the way but it's been a year a year and four months almost five months and i went from doing it every single day to five times a day and then pretty soon i will switch it up again and i will be probably posting three times a day but on those two free days i will be streaming over on twitch so yeah once i get all that done um i'll drop the link and everything on here and we will get that all done but that is it for me tonight, y'all. I'm going to go ahead and skedaddle. So I hope you enjoyed. I hope I gave y'all the energy that you deserve every single time you open up one of my videos. So I pray that y'all's got what you deserve today. So I'm going to leave y'all with this. Put in the energy that you want for what you want to do. And, and I say that because I want to make... A difference in people lives with YouTube and if I'm over here sounding tired and stuff that means I'm not putting forth the energy that I need to do what I want to do if you want to be a football player a basketball player track star tennis a singer a, a musician a writer put in that work and never doubt yourself because guess what if nobody believes in you you believe in yourself and guess what i believe in you so let's get this stuff out the mud this 
work hard let's not give up and let's do this stuff together y'all i'm i'm tired of it i'm i'm ready to make a difference in people's lives so i'm gonna stop rambling on now but remember that put forth the effort that you want okay now i'm gonna skedaddle but y'all know what y'all's got to do i just got to have a good morning a good evening and a good night whenever you're watching my videos i love you guys and i'll see you in the next one